So this is Edmund Barton's coatee. And doesn't it look dazzling? But it didn't arrive in the museum in this condition. So the museum acquired Barton's coatee in 2014. It was handed down through his family from his granddaughter and then through the family line. And although it was well loved, it was in a really fragile state when we received the object. So in particular, the inner silk lining was in very poor condition. It was completely shattered. There were stains from wear, sweat and use. The collar had almost disintegrated and there was a curious red stain inside um, on that silk lining. In collections, our job is to look after objects so that they're ready for display or for research. And the state that the cote was in, it just wasn't able to be handled. It was far too risky. So we had to do a conservation treatment to make it ready for exhibition. So we engaged an expert textile conservator, Deb Spear, and she performed a conservation treatment on the textile so that we could easily handle it, it would be safe in storage, and so that we could put it on display and that our audiences could enjoy it and enjoy all of the stories associated with it. So the conservation treatment involved creating a silk sandwich. So essentially what Deb did was she focused on the lining where all of that shattered silk was evident. She gently unpicked around all the edges of the silk and placed a tulle layer underneath the broken silk and also on top. She then gently manipulated all of those pieces of silk back into their original positions, pinned around them and then painstakingly hand stitched them all into place. So all of the ori original fragments of the garment were still in position. Then to conceal all of that damage, rather than taking it away, she actually put a new layer of silk underneath the damaged silk and she dyed it to be a perfect match with the original fabric. And the way she achieved this was actually quite curious. She used different cups of tea and coffee. So she said that she tested a whole range of products, found the perfect combination and colour matched that silk layer behind the broken shards of silk. So one of the most exciting aspects of doing a conservation treatment is that we get to spend a lot of close time with the object. That in combination with doing some curatorial research with that, which our curator Stephanie Fennigworth did, reveals a whole lot of information about the object and all the time period it was created and the person who wore it. Now some of the clues in the garment that we discovered were some obvious ones like that red ink stain some less obvious ones, like the um, tear in the back of the centre, the centre back of the garment, questioning why that might have happened. And then a completely unexpected discovery was a hidden pocket in the tails of the coatee. Now everyone loves a hidden pocket, but you can imagine our delight when we found a handkerchief inscribed with Barton's name and a place card inside that pocket. So the object revealed many clues for us to continue our journey of investigation.